Is that crooked? It looks it is so crooked. crooked. It's like. I think it's okay. I think. Let's all be like that. Why is it, why is it like... <laughs> that might actually be funny. Yes. Yeah. Like the whole video, way. everybody's leaning. Yeah. <laughs> Blew my mind, man. You guys are sitting at a 45 degree angle. The whole video. <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? We are here tonight with Kyle and McKenna from Got Love. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Hope you checked out our video on their channel. We just had dinner. We had delicious Himalayan food. Delicious? No. no. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. Interesting. <laughs> Hope you checked out our video on their channel. We just had Himalayan food for dinner and now we have got some delicious dessert to try. So let's dig in. We are sampling. Uh, I'm gonna throw in. Yeah. We're sampling uh, a bunch of they call them Sammies. They're ice cream sandwiches, gourmet ice cream, ice cream sandwiches. Gourmet, I can say that three times fast. <laughs> gourmet ice cream sandwiches from Cool House. Since the spring of 2009, Cool House's one-of-a-kind ice cream sandwiches have been served from a converted postal truck that is always on the move. I've never seen or tasted anything like this. I've been reading about it online. A lot of people are saying a lot of good things. Named after the legendary architect Rem Koolhaas, this confectionery concept was designed by former architect Natasha Case. Basically how it works is the customers choose a cookie and then choose an ice cream to go with it. It used to be to have a food truck because Alex yeah, Borneschelle right from the Food Network says it's one of her favorite oh, food trucks. Oh cool. It smells delicious. Yeah, and they make these super gourmet uh, flavors and they have a shop actually not too far from where we live so we picked up a bunch of them so we're going to be trying a bunch of different flavors today what? yeah awesome. this is going to be awesome try this one and tell me what you think oh okay let's okay. guess the flavor yeah. let's do it let's do it okay guess the flavor. i'm like sitting here waiting yeah. to hear and then i'm like yeah. that's it's cinnamon something i don't know I, I haven't tried it yet oh though. horchata that's a good i haven't that, tried it that, that's what it smells like it's definitely it. a cinnamon taste in there it's coconut you know. It tastes like everything! The cookie's like a snickerdoodle. Cause it, I was gonna say it kinda like, is it like a cookie dough? It's good, by the way. I think snickerdoodle was a good guess. Yeah. Well, definitely... snickerdoodle is the cookie. Mm -hmm. the cookie. Like, oh. you, you get to pick your ice cream and then you pick a cookie and oh, you make a sandwich. Oh. Okay, so snickerdoodle with cinnamon cookie yeah, dough. Yeah, ice cream. Uh, <laughs> if you're gonna, cinnamon. you're gonna tell me that it's gonna be one of those things where I'm like, oh. Yeah. All right, what is it? Okay, so this is their street cart churro flavor. Churro, okay. Mm. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, yeah okay, snicker so, with cookie. Perfect. Not so something I would have guessed, obviously, but. You're close, though. I don't okay, know where the coconut came from originally, but. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But I was like cinnamon y and like, yeah. Mm. And so you paired it, like you chose the ice cream and the cookie? Ooh. Good pairing. Yeah. You're good. You <laughs> good. <laughs> so this is makeup for dinner? Yeah. <laughs> I thought we were gonna have dinner from the same plate, or uh, dessert. I thought we were gonna have dessert from the same plate. Oh, okay. I wouldn't do that to you. Yeah. <laughs> in case it didn't work out. Yeah, uh, so there were bones in the right, dessert. You can't, you can't. <laughs> <laughs> the yak, yak ice cream set. <laughs> but for real, you guys, you guys have to check out the first video. Yeah. Also, give this video a thumbs up because yeah. this ice cream's already amazing. Yeah, this yeah. Is, yeah. This is super good. Oh, oh crikey, what is this? Okay, I'll take this a little one. That is... All right, this is definitely the... Um, um, fruity Pebbles. Yeah, Fruity <laughs> Pebbles. I was gonna say fruity. Oh, yes! This smells so... It just, like brings back those childhood memories. Yeah. I don't know if it brings it back for you guys because you have a child, so... <laughs> <laughs> You're like, this, this is every day. This is every day. This looks like a unicorn threw up on the ice cream here. <laughs> <laughs> Which is popular right yeah. now. <laughs> right. right. It's Fruity Pebbles. Yeah. And it is a Fruity Pebble and patty. And Fruit Loops. And Fruit Loop there ice cream. Fruit Loop ice cream. Oh, you're right. It's called Fruit Loop cereal milk. So uh, they even, I think, get the milk from the cereal. They just pour it all together and make huh. an ice cream sandwich out of it. They make ice cream out of milk. <laughs> that is revolutionary. I get what you're saying. <laughs> Fruit Loop milk. Like Wait, after you I'm eat the cereal milk. and like the milk has the flavor. The milk, right. I got you. <laughs> yeah. See. I guess technically they make ice cream out of cream. So I'm trying to be a. Smart Alex, <laughs> blew up in my face. It's almost like it's like kind of like a Fruit Loop Rice Krispie Treat little yes, bit. Yeah, exactly. Like yeah, together. that crispiness. I think it's fine. I'm not a huge fan of like the fruity cereals. Like they're fine, but I know somebody who is. 
I just like sweet. If you're ever having one of those days where it's like, you know, I'm, I'm feeling really snacky, like I don't know if I want a cookie or ice cream or cereal, just have it all together. Right. Oh, That's what you go for. We used to have these cereals growing up, but they were snack cereals, so we weren't allowed to have them for breakfast. We could only have them for like, oh. you know, we get home from the pool yeah. or whatever after school snack. You'd have a bowl of Fruit Loops or peanut butter crunch or whatever, but not for you breakfast. We had some very strict parents. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what is this? Is this ice cream gray? <laughs> <laughs> it's the first time I've ever seen gray ice cream. It's gray. It is absolutely it's gray. Gray ice cream. <gasps> yes, it is. Oh, this smell? is weirder than any of those Don't tell me it's like this black licorice no, ice cream. It smells like what gray, gray <laughs> ice cream would smell like. It smells like that's gray. Like if, if, that's I, the best if you were closing time. your eyes right now and I was like, smell this, you'd be like, is that gray <laughs> ice cream? <laughs> So I'm like, wow, how'd you know? I don't know what the cookie would be called. If it would be called like a wedding cookie or like a tuxedo cookie. It's like a moon pie. Is it awful? <laughs> No, there's <laughs> peanut butter in this. It's peanut butter and metal. <laughs> like if you took, I, I do sheet metal for the Air Force, and if you took <laughs> aluminum, aluminum dust, and you like took a scoop of aluminum dust and put it in a peanut butter can and mixed it up, and then we're like, here we go, ice cream. <laughs> That's what it tastes like. And it would look just like that. Yeah. I know this is gonna be really weird, and this is not the flavor at all, but it kind of has, like some kind of sp like Japanese spice flavor to me. Like I know that. Is it Benny Emo? No, I don't know what that is. Is it oh. soy sauce? No, Benny Emo so in is the right direction. A really? Purple sweet potato there. It's black sesame. Sesame. Oh, sesame. Yeah. I love black. So why peanut is butter. It's so I sesame. don't but love it tastes sesame. Like peanut butter, right? Yeah. I love peanut Asian butter and food. metal. I love Asian food, yeah. but whenever I have to use sesame oil, I use like a fourth of what it calls for. Oh, yeah. really? Now that I know like that. Sesame. Yeah, oh my god! Okay, I actually has a very oily flavor to it. I almost yeah, didn't no. even say that because I'm like, this is gonna sound so weird. <laughs> no, I absolutely love, love, love black sesame ice cream. This just doesn't taste like the kinds I've had. But I don't know what. I have never right, but... even heard of that in ice cream before. Oh my gosh, yeah. it's so good. But yeah. maybe not. <laughs> Good choice with the cookie, this though. This is good, yeah. <laughs> You're just gonna eat around it. The ice, <laughs> the ice cream's not good, but... I'm going back to the fruit loops. Oh my gosh. All right. All right, now Thank that I know it. this is black sesame, I like it even more. <laughs> yeah, the cookie is like yellow cake with a shell, like a chocolate and vanilla shell. All right. All right, well, what is this? Whoa. There you go. It's probably... It's orange, so orange with little black flecks. It's in probably it. like curry now. Oh, <laughs> All right. Okay, so we have like a sprinkle. Oh, it's kind of like a, a funfetti cookie. Oh yeah. Is that, yeah, it's definitely is like that crushed Oreo in it? Mine has a big chunk of something. Child's birthday cake cookie around. Like it's like a big glob on your cookie. But Oreo. Oh. I think so. Oh. It's like tea. Tea flavored ice cream or something. Where? Wait, we were just talking about it. The Himalayas? No. <laughs> oh, Thailand. Yes, Thai tea. Thai what? Tea. I'm not sure I've actually had Thai tea just as regular. I think it tastes pretty tea. good. I like the smushy cookie though. The first bite, I was like, I don't know, it's kind of gross. But now that I like actually know it's tea, I'm like, alright, it's not bad. <laughs> okay. All right. Ooh, it looks like some sort of. Cheesecake! Oatmeal cookie? Yeah, some sort of... You want the bigger one? Not yet. <laughs> Not yet until you know what it is. Um, yeah, it looks like a, like a raspberry or blueberry cheesecake. But I feel bad because you don't get a guess. You know all the answers. No, I know. <laughs> she doesn't. And there's do. little flecks of yellow in here. I don't even know what those are. All the smells are blending together. <laughs> <laughs> I can't tell if it's just like a regular chocolate chip cookie or if it's like a different, like an oatmeal. Yeah, cookie. I know. I thought it was oatmeal at first, but yeah, now there's are I'm not 100% sure what the cookie is actually. I have like no sense of smell, so it's so hard to. It's totally a cheesecake. I just burped and I tasted chili. <laughs> <laughs> Ew! 
yak this is like chili. Yak chili. <laughs> nice. Like yak ice cream. I know what that. Wait. I know that taste. Ice cream tastes like yak. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. TMI. So it does have like a little bit of raspberry flavor. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I want like a raspberry yogurt or something. I'm gonna stick with raspberry. Yeah. Either, so. It's blueberry sweet corn. What? Like, you well, said yellow specs. There's yellow specs. Okay, well that explains we'll that. Let's try the yogurt. It's, I mean, blueberry. the ice cream itself, without the cookie. Yeah. You can definitely taste a little bit more of the. Yeah, you get. You, get, you have to do that. Yeah. Get that. Mix, mix the it all in there. Yeah. <laughs> it's like wine. Yeah. <laughs> but. <laughs> glorious. It's, it's I still get, really good. I can get the good. blueberry now, but the corn. I'm from Iowa. <laughs> I know corn. There is no corn in this. Yeah, there is. Corn is such a mild flavor. I'm surprised yeah. that I just ate a really piece of the yellow spec. But it's still, it's really sweet. It's not like a weird, like sweet and savory combination. It's still sweet. Mm -hmm. I like it. I don't care for the cookie. It I tastes like a cookie. Tastes like one of those cookies that aren't real cookies. Like if you have dietary restrictions. You <laughs> <laughs> Really? Because they had like gluten free ones, and I was just picking ones that I thought. Oh, jeez. Okay, there may be like some sort of. You might be right. Yeah. All right, the last one. You guys ready? Yep. I have a boat full of sesame and tea. <laughs> okay, this one melted a little on the way home, so I apologize in advance. It's a little melty. Ooh, is that all right? Okay. It's like a brownie cookie. Like Rocky Road. I haven't tried it yet. They had normal I'm not gonna flavor. guess. I actually, I actually know the idea. I forget yeah. the specifics. I know the idea of what's in this because he had to explain the meltiness to me. I know, I know what it is. What it's is a it? uh, amaretto. Medicine. <laughs> <laughs> like no, it's rum. I got liquid medicine. It's rum. It's on the right track. It's Captain Morgan. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? It's amaretto and rum. It's Maker's Mark. Maker's Mark? Maker's Mark. Oh, yeah. so it's whiskey. Yeah. I think Maker's Mark is whiskey, right? Yeah, it's whiskey. Yeah. But, <laughs> like a lot of things that they, Whoa. a lot of desserts and things, like, you know, uh, Kahlua cheesecake at the Cheesecake Factory, mm -hmm. there's no alcohol in it. They burn it off. Oh. Well, but, this is alcohol. No, but when they made these, <laughs> so then what's the point? They, <laughs> they had to remake it because by the time they finished the sixth one, it had melted already. And they told me because there's alcohol in it, it oh. doesn't freeze properly. They do each one individually. Yeah, they make yeah. it for you there. Whoa! Yeah. So by the time she got to the sixth one, this one, the Maker's Mark one, had already melted because it has. She said it has alcohol in it, so it doesn't freeze that well. You know, because alcohol doesn't mm. freeze, so that's why it's kind of mushy. I've only tried whiskey like once or twice. Like bones with your yak and whiskey yeah. with your ice cream. <laughs> My favorite was definitely the Free Pebbles one. Mm. Second favorite would have been the original we tried, like the the churro. That was so good. And yeah. my third favorite would be the um, blueberry corn one. <laughs> <laughs> Did you ever think you'd say that? That just sounds so weird. <laughs> my third favorite ice cream was no, blueberry corn. Blueberry sweet corn. I'm so <laughs> glad we got to try these though. Yeah. yeah. I would say sesame. my favorite's the my. Oh, okay, I'm definitely in the minority here. My favorite is the black sesame. Yeah, yeah black that's sesame. no one else's favorite. No, yeah, no one else even ate it. There's like. <laughs> Great ice creams, like all of. Do you eat yours? I put mine away. <laughs> I ate the cookie. Is that count? Yeah. <laughs> and then, um, yeah, the the churro and yeah, probably the blueberry. I wasn't a huge fan of the, the cereal one. The unicorn vomit. The unicorn vomit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah you're just gonna hate. What was your favorite, Kyle? I like yeah, the churro one was by far my favorite. Mm. And then the fruity pebble one, probably second, and then this one. The whiskey the one. Drunk one. Part, yeah. <laughs> this is not fair. <laughs> yeah. This is my third favorite, and then the other three are sitting there. <laughs> <laughs> I could have got flavors that were all just super tasty because they have some amazing flavors. That wouldn't have been fun. No. But, yeah, that wouldn't have been so fun. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. We'd be yak have... and corn ice cream in one sitting. You have to get something terrible like uh, sesame. What were your favorites? <laughs> your top three. <laughs> well, the churros. The best, I think. Yeah. Really, yeah. really, really good. Um, I, yeah, I like the Fruit Loop cereal milk one, and yeah, I guess the blueberry sweet corn. Even though I don't taste really the corn. Yeah. No, much. I didn't either. Yeah. It yeah. kind of just tastes of like a blueberry. I'm telling you, I'm from Iowa. There's no corn in there. You can see <laughs> the corn. You can in see it. You can see it. 
So that was our sampling of the Cool House flavors. Um, comment down below and tell us what you think. If any of these flavors sound good to you, what your favorite is. Maybe you had some of them. Or which ones were disgusting. Or, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we definitely have some Perfect. varying opinions here. <laughs> Be sure to check out Kyle and McKenna, Got Love. Also, McKenna's got a channel, Kyle's got a channel. He's We're like, full of channels. Yeah. All the YouTubes. Yeah. 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 So many, they're all over the YouTubes. Um, and also the first video where we actually had dinner and this is dessert. So be sure to check out that video as well. We'll link it below. And give this video a thumbs up and please like and subscribe. See you next time. See ya. Bye. Bye. Oh, awesome. Good. <laughs> Talking to my friends like that's something that I'm used to. I never cash out, so I just wanted him to lose you. Damn. Puffing on that bullshit on Uncle Sam. Who would have thought that he would understand? And I just never fall out. I just want to win. I'm in it for the long run. I do this on my fam. Something is wrong with the way, and I don't know why.